Church, my name's Siobhan and I lead our Icon Campus in Derby. It's an amazing privilege to get to speak to you today. So I'd love it if you could join me in turning to 1 Corinthians 9 and we're going to start in verse 19. And it says this, Even though I am a free man with no master, I have become a slave to all people to bring many to Christ. When I was with the Jews, I lived like a Jew to bring the Jews to Christ. When I was with those who followed the Jewish law, I too lived under the law. Even though I'm not subject to the law, I did this so I could bring to Christ those who are under the law. When I am with the Gentiles who do not follow the Jewish law, I too live apart from the law so that I can bring them to Christ. But I do not ignore the law of God. I obey the law of Christ. When I am with those who are weak, I share their weakness, for I want to bring the weak to Christ. Yes, I try to find common ground with everyone, doing everything I can to save some. I do everything to spread the good news and share in its blessing. You know, if I was to title this devotion anything, it would be this, the Christ-like chameleon. We've got an amazing guy in our church and his name is Tom Moores. And what Tom is so good at doing is connecting with everyone and anyone. He has this amazing ability to be able to adapt his own life experiences, to be able to relate to other people. And the reason why I share this story with you today is because that's exactly what Paul is talking about in this passage in 1 Corinthians. He's talking about this idea of being adaptable. And you know, I feel like this is so fitting for the season that we're in right now, because in this time of lockdown, we've all had to adapt. You know, maybe you're a parent and you've had to adapt to being a teacher. Maybe you're a student and you've had to adapt to having online lectures. Maybe you've had to adapt to working from home. We've all had to adapt in this season. But the encouragement from this passage is that actually when we allow ourselves to adapt, it allows God to create opportunity. That when Paul allowed himself to adapt, to relate to these different groups of people, it allowed God to create opportunity for Paul to share the good news with these people. Now, I mentioned that the title of this devotion was The Christ-like Chameleon, and you're probably thinking that that's a little bit strange. Well, I'm sure that we all know from growing up that we have this idea that a chameleon disguises itself, that it adapts its colours to blend into its background. But I did a little bit of research on chameleons and found out that actually the primary reason why a chameleon adapts, the primary reason why a chameleon changes its colours, is to communicate its emotions. You know, a chameleon goes darker to show that it's angry, it goes lighter to attract other chameleons. And the reason why I share this this morning is because actually I think there's an encouragement in this that maybe we need to be adaptable on the outside to share the Christ conviction that we have on the inside. Maybe we need to adapt our outer appearance in order to communicate the love of Christ. You know, maybe this season is actually one where we need to step out of our comfort zone and adapt our actions to be able to communicate the love of God. You know, you might be someone who is not used to being in a season like this. You may be not used to communicating with people over the phone or over video chat. You're used to the face to face. Well, maybe this is a season where you need to adapt what's on the outside in order to communicate the love of Christ on the inside. Maybe we need to adapt our communication, adapt what we're speaking on the outside to communicate what God is doing on the inside. Maybe we need to adapt our habits to communicate what God is doing on the inside. My encouragement for, for us this morning and the thought that I want to encourage you to think on is how can I adapt to allow God to use me? How can I adapt to allow God to use me? You know, because God wants to use us more and more. And I believe that actually, if we're willing to adapt in this season, that we'll create an opportunity for God to use us in an even greater way. So church, it's been a pleasure to speak to you this morning. I'm just going to pray for us. And then I'm just believing that we're going to have a really amazing week. 
So Heavenly Father, I just thank you for what you're doing through us already. I thank you for your word and I just pray that we would really be able to grab a hold of it this morning. I pray that you'd help us to be adaptable in order to communicate your message of love to the people around us more clearly, Father. I pray that like Paul, you would help us to adapt in a way to communicate better, to relate to people in a better way so that we can see more people come to know your love and come to know your grace. And we just pray that in your name. Amen.